So I'm going to be showing you a hardware crack of the iPhone, showing how you can crack the pin for a stolen device. Now, in this particular case, we're going to be using a commercial tool called the Elcom Soft iOS Forensic Toolkit. It's commercial, you have to pay for it, and in many cases, you have to actually demonstrate that you're involved in forensics, which we are. Um, there are also freeware tools around, for example, the, I, the iPhone Data Protection Suite, rather ironically named for it, really. Um, that can be done freeware, but you have to build your RAM disk every time. Um, using this particular suite, it's, it's much easier to do. It's much more point and click, frankly. It is restricted by hardware versions. As you can see, you're only going up to the iPhone version 4 um, and the iPad, iPad first generation. So it is quite limited, but it does show you how important it is to keep your hardware version bang up to date. So if you've got any iPad 1s in your organization, you've got an iPhone 4s, not 4s, um, then you've got uh, potentially got problems if some of the devices is stolen. So what I've done, we put the, um, the iPhone into DFU, or Device Firmware Update Mode. That involves some, a particular sequence of key presses by holding this and that. You can find out online, it's very easy to do. Um, we've now got to the point where we're ready to go, and we are going to be uh, going for number 14. We've got an iPhone um, 4 GSM here. So we start that running, and off we go. There we go. It's now uploading a, a RAM disk. Uh, I'm going to create our custom boot ROM for us, and off we go. So you can now see we're now running the Alcomsoft RAM disk. So let's move on. Now, as you can see, we've got several options now. So the one that we really want to be doing here is, frankly, getting the passcode. So that's option six. Very straightforward to do. Off we go and continue through this. So we'll now continue with our pass crack. And there we go, we found that in 13 seconds, we got the pin. Now obviously that was a relatively easy pin, it was relatively low down the, uh, the number um, cycle, but 1980, there we go, 13 seconds later. So this is why it's so important to keep your um, iOS hardware bang up to date. If you've got an iPhone 4, an iPad 1, it gets nicked, you've got problems.